Okay, I'm not saying that the battery life on the micro cinema camera is bad, but I wanted more runtime. And the Canon LPE6, which this is powered off of, is um, this is a capacity of Canon's battery. They don't make a larger capacity LPE6. They only come in this size and capacity only varies a little bit, not very much. Now, as far, as far as Sony batteries go, you can get something as big as this guy right here, which would give you some crazy runtime. Now, both of these are seven volt batteries. So ideally they can be, you know, you can use this to power up your cinema camera. Now, Blackmagic solution for external power is this spaghetti adapter that they added with the camera. It connects via a serial port and then it has a bunch of breakout cables here. One of them is used to power 12 volt so you can use a external battery. Now this to me is ugly and if I just need a battery these cables are just too unnecessary and then you've got this extra bulk hanging off the side. So instead of using external power I decided to tap into the LPE6 here. Now what I've done is I've taken one of these cheap trays off of a cheap battery charger for a Sony battery and then I took a dummy battery like this. These are dummy batteries that are used to power uh, like Canon cameras or monitors or something. And then I kind of hacked it up and put the two together and came out with this guy. So I've got a dummy battery over here and then I've got the tray over here and uh, I plastic welded this thing on as well as added some two part epoxy. So this thing is a, uh, a rock right now and I, I want to make sure that it holds up a heavier battery. So basically, now what I could do is I attach this here and I've converted my micro cinema camera to accept larger capacity Sony batteries. Now this again is still seven volts, so it's gonna be the same as this, no problem. Now we mount this to the back and then we turn this on. As you can see, we have an image here. So we're able to power up our micro cinema camera with a larger capacity battery and um, you know we're gonna run for a long time without having to fuss with this mess right over here um, so anyways thought I'd share that little DIY hack converting your micro cinema camera from a Canon LPE6 to a Sony L series battery and again this is my switch here I've got a battery meter back here but what's interesting is the meter does show from the micro cinema camera when it's full and then um, this will display a green light here on the front um, and then if your battery's low th that kind of blinks yellow uh, i think that's for the battery meter so um, it's still detected fine anyways uh yeah it works out if you guys have any questions hit me up cheesycam.com